and that's a really hard one too because you get like your average cam del s in a club race car with a wet sump and they get in it and they start it and they don't bother about nothing and they race it and the thing could last three years they do last a long time and then you go all right this engine's three times as much money but you've got to bring it back three times as often it doesn't make sense to them but it's a hard one to explain well and you don't even necessarily need to bring it back because it's got problems but if we don't keep on top of stuff when it does have a problem it's going to be a big problem like even as simple as every time one of my engines run oil, I always want to see the oil filter. And then you've got to cut the oil filter every event. They go, oh God, I've got to buy an oil filter every time I drive it. It's like, well, yeah. It's a pretty small expense. <laughs> and then priming oil pressure up. You need to spin the oil pump. They're like, oh God, that's a big job. Then you've got to heat the oil up as well. So you get a lot of customers that they want all this power. And even if they've got the budget for it, sometimes they don't really fully understand the workload that comes of actually running an engine at that level yeah exactly 